here in the finals. We'll play first. That is a good hand. That was a good draw. Hmm. I see. All right. Well, let's bust out the old Herald. Let's save his life. Definitely seems worth it to me. Um, all right, let's just bash in. Probably eats our vigilance guy, but I'm okay with that. So, best use of our mana is Hooded Assassin. Lightwalker. Uh, I'm actually going to play the Lightwalker. I think Hooded Assassin could still have some value as a removal spell. All right, got us there. Ooh, I'd like to play that. Um, I think we're still going to save our Hooded Assassin. I have a feeling we're going to need that. Like, as soon as he plays a threat, it can't deal with. Well, that's not exactly the threat I was looking for. Oh, he probably has a combat trick. All right. I see. All right. So we gain some life. Regeneration shield's gone. And then we'll play Hooded Assassin and finish that thing off. Two cards left in hand. All right. I guess we'll offer the trade. I mean, I could wait till I get another land to do uh, tactician, but I don't like it. Looks like he's not too keen on it either. Huh. It's interesting. Okay.
Ooh. Uh, no cards left in hand. Well... Yeah, let's just swing. No cards left in hand. That's a good sign. I mean, granted, we don't know what his morph is, but... Alright. I guess he did end up getting us, unfortunately. Pretty good, unfortunately. But we've got two spells in hand. He's drawn off the top. Granted, we can't play anything yet, but... Very close to lethal. We're actually a land away from lethal with Tactician. Okay. Found a creature. Not one I'm overly concerned about. So what? I swing with everything he blocks Reaper and eh. We'll just swing with this. Okay. Looks as though we have lethal. Can only block two guys. No cards left in hand. Do I even want to show him pacifism? I actually think I don't. No cards left in hand? He can't do anything. All right. No reason to show him a pacifism to let him bring in naturalize or whatever. Um, otherwise, he's seen nothing else to bring in naturalize for. So, yeah. Uh, green, black, value. He's already shown us some good spells. Pacifism is actually not too bad against Team or Sabretooth. Um, only when you cast it on the Sabretooth, though, in regards to any other creature we have, it's pretty horrific against Team or Sabretooth. So, unfortunately, Sabretooth is a big problem. Flatten and Deathwind are certainly good. Butcher's Glee is a good way to come back into the game since we're aggressive. Multiple Guardian Shield Bears, so his deck looks good. I mean, he did make it to the finals. Not to be overlooked. I could swap a Pacifism for a Foul Tongue Invocation. Um, how do I feel about that? Not great. Not great. Pacifism's not great on... Well, it's good on a Marsh Hulk, but... Hmm. Like I said, it's only okay on a team or Sabretooth. It's not good against a team or Sabretooth. I guess I'll keep it the same. Uh, 
Um, yeah, this hand's acceptable. Opponent keeps. That was a good draw, but gonna need the swamp to make that sweet synergy work. Hmm. Not sure I want to make this trade. Do I really want to pacify a guardian shield bearer though? Not especially. It's not like pacifism is getting better later though. Hmm. Guess we wait. All right, well, pacifying a Colossidon yearling certainly seems better. All right, got some options now. Didn't find the swamp, but we'll pacify this and bash for two. Still bashing. All right. Let's drop the Herald, I guess. Although, yeah, we want the Vigilance. I'll take it. Battle Brawler seems like something we should be building towards. All right. Elkert's pretty good. If we get a black mana, though, we're okay. No black mana, though, and we got some problems. We got a black mana. We could have attacked into Elkert and Hooded Assassined it. All right. Not much we can do here. We just didn't find our black mana. So, black mana, and we can drop the hand of Silimgar, but I guess it's not that good. Maybe the Cobra to keep other stuff back, but oof. All right. Just didn't find a black mana. It happens. We'll move to game three, see if we can't draw a little bit better. Had a good hand for when we did have a black mana. But no black mana. Not going to do too much. Um, once again, Foul Tongue Invocation rather than a pacifism. Now that he knows about pacifism, it's not a bad idea, actually. I guess Glaring Aegis isn't terrible, but it's not very good against Klossidon Yearling. Foul Tongue's good against Sabretooth. I feel like we bring it in. Let's take out a Pacifism. The question is, do I want to do Glaring Aegis? I don't think I do. Doesn't seem right. Let's try it again. Yeah, this ain't fine. It's a good draw. Let's open with the Herald. I feel like Lightwalker is better for when we get... Uh, 
some plus one plus one counters going. Alright. We'll bust the old coat with venom. No plays here is nice. Sadisi is actually a pretty good draw. All right, looking good. We've even got foul tongue. Hmm. All right. Although I guess Falton's not so good against Sultai Emissary, is it? Hope he just plays a saber tooth. That'd be great. All right, Cobra's a good draw. Although it's not so good against the defeat, is it? I mean, it's not like I'm playing around defeat. Wow, multiple death wins. It's pretty it's pretty awesome for him. All right. At least we got a nice out for that. Guess we'll swing. Kind of want to scale blessing this anyway. I mean, foul tongue's instant, so we can wait. Like, if he uses a fight spell here, that would be... Well, I guess that wouldn't work out so well for him. Wish I had a dragon. I definitely want to leave up Scale Blessing to protect against defeat, but I don't know if I... Angler, perhaps? Looks like it. Likely, yeah. All right. Skirmisher. Sandcrafter Mage. Um, Mage is actually pretty good with Scale Blessing. Well... Guess it's not that great with skill blessing. I think we just get in. All right. So we'll sandblast the angler. Although I guess it's kind of a telegraph, but whatever. Didn't have the butcher's glee, so pretty thankful for that. All right, he does have lifelink, though. Something to be concerned about. Um, so I don't want to play Sidisi. No cards left in hand. I think we just bust Sandcrafter Mage, play Sidisi next turn, sack the Mage, 
And, uh... Guess I could swing with Cobra. He cracks back with Kinguard. I trade? No, I think Sidisi's gonna find uh, Archfiend of Depravity. That's not a bad draw either. Let's uh let's swing first. Should have actually played the well, no, I guess that didn't make sense. Playing the Dragon Hunter didn't make sense. I mean, I'm okay with that trade, like I said. This is actually an interesting trade. Um, so I think I just kill the 3-3 three, three and the 2-2. Two, two. And then we'll drop DC. Sack the mage. And yes, and we'll dig up the old Archfiend. Tomb Shell, definitely not a big deal. No chumps, which is good for us, actually. Um, I think we actually, oddly enough, just play Archfiend, and then we don't even drop the Dragon Hunter, because then Scale Blessing is actually lethal next turn. Yeah. That was a good one to manifest for him. All right. Well, we got the old 8-4. Pretty cool. Uh, so next draft will be an 8-4. This deck played really well for us. So I'm glad it all came together. Hope you enjoyed it. And we'll see you for the next draft.